welcome my YouTube viewers. I have just begun streaming on Twitch and forgot to hit the record button, so let me welcome y'all in here too. Uh, <clears throat> we are, um, kind of repeat what I just said, we are loading up Imperium Galactic Survival because we are going to be getting some screenshots that we can work with because we are going to be recreating all of our builds from Imperium Galactic Survival into POIs in Seven Days to Die. So definitely welcome us or welcome y'all to the stream. And if you can't make the live stream tonight, that's fine. Chief's got you because we will be uploading this video to the YouTube channel. That way you can come back and view it. And definitely comments are welcome. Suggestions are welcome. Uh, here on Twitch, just throw them in the chat message window right here that I can see. And on my um, YouTube channel, just throw it down below. And, of course, my Discord link should be on my uh, Twitch channel somewhere around here. Uh, definitely uh, subscribe to the Discord for even more updates. Uh, like and subscribe to my YouTube channel, which that should be floating around here somewhere also. I don't know. I don't know if I've even updated it. But, hey, you know, you can find me. It's easy to find me. It's not like I'm hiding. Uh, but definitely, if you want to stay updated, definitely uh, uh, hit up a follower on Twitch, and you will be catching my live streams here on Twitch, and you can talk with me back and forth live as I'm streaming. And if you can't make live streams, definitely like and subscribe over on my YouTube channel and you can be able to comment. This is going to hurt. Nope, it didn't hurt. Um Let's see. There we go. Uh So definitely uh, you know, like, tag, follow along and all that stuff. Now we are going to be getting some screenshots of the outside especially is what we're actually here for is to get some screenshots okay all right let's see do we need to go back a little bit more maybe um let's go ahead and grab that screenshot right there and that that's kind of silly um <laughs> okay so my shortcut key to my screenshots is what turns my uh <laughs> that, that, that's stupid uh my shortcut screen that i use or key for my shortcuts uh to capture the screen is um linked to my screen disable <laughs> in the <laughs> Um, um, uh, it was linked to, yeah, it, it, it's, it's just my screen off that y'all were viewing. This <laughs> is kind of silly. All right, so we're going to work with it anyhow. All right. So if you see the video flicker on your end, then that's why it's flickering, folks. It's because of the screen. That's a stupid cheap. Come on now. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and back up a little bit. All right. All right. And let's get a uh, top. I, I mean, I've got screenshots and stuff like that, um, but we're going to uh, grab some new ones just in case measures. Now, I'm not quite sure. Uh, let's see. Here we go. I'm not quite sure how we're going to do the um, the weapons and stuff on the ship. Um, and, we, you know, we might can do some weapons that would look um, uh, that would look similar to the weapons on it. Um, you know, with each game system, like the uh, Abigail version for uh, Interstellar Rift, um, definitely has um, a few changes that had to take place. Uh, so, yeah, you know, just got to be open-minded about it. All right. 
now let's uh, spawn in some other stuff. Uh, right, let's see here. Um, let's see here. Um, I'm not sure what that one is. Okay, that's one of the very early versions, which is the same thing that we got here now. All right, now here's a destroyed version. I deliberately destroyed the uh, Abigail for this. Um, so yeah, we're gonna have uh, a few of them. Like I said, this is the Jade class starship, so we're gonna have multiple copies. Um, we'll just take a screenshot like that. Okay. All right, now let's uh, bring in for the very first time that I know of that y'all have seen is the aerial class starship. Okay. We are going to take, uh, now we're going to change this up. I haven't got around to updating this uh, little ship right here yet. But we're going to go ahead and capture a few screenshots of that one because I'm going to change the design up just a wee bit. But this is a uh, frigate to the um, Jade class and the Chief class. Uh, I don't even know if I still have the Chief class nowhere, but I, I have the screenshots and the design of the Chief class. But we're going to get a little side shot right here. Okay, let's see, let's back up, and green shot, okay, and then get a little screenshot of this right here, of the rear, uh, let's kind of get it at a little angle right there, yeah, there we go. All right, now we're going to throw some stuff on top of it, just because we can. All right, let's see here. Hey, y'all recognize this? Those of y'all that don't know, this is from the Death Race. <laughs> yep, from the Death Race, folks, right here, where you can go and get uh stuffs what not have you it's a poi that me and iron wolf uh himself worked on for the death race so kind of get a little uh screenshot on the inside that's close enough all right and then uh let's get kind of a little screenshot like this uh, the bottom right here doesn't necessarily matter, folks. Uh, just an ideal of the generalized shape. And yes, my screen still flickers. Okay, let's see what else we got. Um, this is the Belafonte, which I had talked to the author myself. And he gave me permission to not only rework this ship, put in more weapons and stuff like that, but also gave me permission to re-upload the updated version of the ship to my Steam Workshop. Oh, you're going to crash to the ground, aren't you? Of course you are. Well, we'll just meet it down there. Um, all these ships are going to be POIs in a custom map that we are going to be live streaming here on um, Twitch. And then we will be uploading the video over to um my youtube channel and we're just getting screenshots <clears throat> right now of the ships and pois that we're going to be doing okay and we can somewhat count the blocks in the uh screenshot 
and kind of get a, an idea. Now, it's not going to be exactly the same. You know, that is definitely true. Um, but it's going to be close enough. And I think we can make it look really, really good, guys. And we're going to be doing this um, in vanilla. All right. Now, this lovely thing I had uh, downloaded off the uh, workshop and then retrofitted it, which is the drill miner. It's just a little POI. Let's get a little screenshot of that real quick. All right. Uh, I'm not sure what this one is. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Here, ladies and gentlemen, is the chief class starship. Y'all have not seen this one before. And if you have, you, you may have seen a, uh, a uh, screenshot of it, but a screenshot in passing. Ah, wrong butt dummy. I hit the Windows key. <laughs> All right. There we go. But, yep, this is the Chief Class Star Cruiser. Um, we hadn't come up with a name for this one yet. But, yep, we're just getting these screenshots because that's what we are going to be bringing in as POIs for... Seven Days to Die, Imperium, Galactic Survivor. They meet the two. I know it's going to be exciting, folks. I'm excited to bring you all this. Oh, the sun's a little a little bright, so let's go with this this view of it. Okay, let's... Can we turn the uh, sun down or something? Kind of adjust it a little... Uh, let's see. Um, let's see. Let's... There we go. That that'll have to work. All right. Let's see. All right. Let's go with a front view of this one. Yeah. There we go. All right. There. Um. Let's get a little closer, shall we? That way we can. Kind of get a better look. All right. And then we already got one from the top. Well, we don't really need one from the bottom, per se. Uh, but we need one from the rear. But that's going to fall and crash on the ground. All right. You see, the, the rear is a little different. But, I mean... This was just the, the early design of the Chief Class. Okay. Um, let's see here. Let me grab my uh, link real quick and... Just uh, ah. now, um, for those of y'all that's just tuning in or fixing to tune in, um, which they're fixing to, they just needed the link from me. Um, just a reminder, we are bringing Imperium Galactic Survival builds that I have built in Imperium Galactic Survival over into Seven Days to Die. Um, and we are getting our screenshots to use as reference. Um, that is not my design. It's just uh, one that I uh, was tinkering around with. Uh, that is a... Uh, Somebody had converted that into a capital ship for me. <laughs> it's kind of huge, but yeah. 
All right, let's see here. Um, these are some. Uh, oop! Come on. Really? Why are you being? There you go. These are some directional poles for the um, death rays. Is what these are right here. Okay, let the uh, player know which direction to go. All right, now all these doesn't necessarily mean uh, that they're mine. I just named them that so I could have a uh, reference to go by. Uh, we're going to go ahead and continue. All right. Let's see. Continue. I'm not sure what happened here. Okay. Well, apparently that uh has uh, some issues. All right. Now, this is where I got the ideal from the, uh, of course, it didn't have all these weapons and stuff like that from the, uh, and it didn't have a hanger either from the Steam Workshop. Is what inspired me for all these other uh, uh, let's see screenshot there we go but that's what what inspired me um, to do the um, Abigail the chief and stuff like that let's go ahead and get a screenshot of this all right I think we have enough to get us started, folks. All right, so we're going to exit out of Imperium Galactic Survival now that we've got the screenshots and stuff like that. Go wait. And then we're going to load up Seven Days to Die, and we're going to load up the POI creator, editor thing. All right, let's see. Obviously, you can see I've been playing other games, so I need to pull up uh, the Seven Days to Die library. Here we go. All right, let's go ahead and play this bad boy now. Go ahead and minimize Steam. And we need to decide what are we going to build first as a POI. Let's work on the... Let's work on the aerial class. Very good. Yeah? What do you think? That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. So while that's loading up, I'm going to get up, get a refill of coffee real, real quick. Be right back. All right, folks, I am back. Mmm, good coffee. <laughs> Booker decided to come in from the yard, too. <laughs> All right, we are going to go into editing tools, and these uh, allow us to edit uh, maps and worlds and all this good stuff, but we're going to go into the prefab editor. Okay. Take a few seconds for that to load up. Oh, I'm excited, guys. Very excited to bring y'all this. Which nobody's ever done this yet. So, load the 
doggy hair off my keyboard real quick. But yeah, I mean, I've seen beautiful POIs and maps and user created maps and all that stuff, but nobody's ever that I have came across recreated something that they've done in another game. So we need to figure out how long we can make the POI versus how wide, how tall. Obviously, by these cities right here, you can make it pretty doggone tall. So that will give us enough room for the height and the bottom. So we're going to lay out some grid markers and stuff like that. Here's where I was experimenting with some POIs and stuff like that, some in-game POIs and seeing how they function and stuff. But we're going to uh, go ahead and create a new POI. Uh, create new POI. All right, I'm assuming that this gives us how big we can make this POI. What do y'all think? All right, so we need a couple of tools. We're going to need some dev stuff. All right. Let's see here. We have the uh Let's see, we'll need one of these. We don't need that. Uh, I'm not sure. We'll go ahead and take a hammer too. Um, we will definitely need the uh, paintbrush. Where's the paintbrush? Ah, yes. We will definitely need that. Okay. And then we're going to need some steel. Because I'm willing to bet steel is going to be the hardest resource in the game. We'll start off with a couple of uh, steel blocks. Okay, so this is going to be ground level. Um, north, south, um, north, south, east, west. Let's go with, that's north. Let's do one. Let's see. Going east to west, north, south, and stuff like that. Um, that way when it spawns in the game, um, it'll, uh, I'm assuming this is uh, the size of the map. Maybe. It may be the size of the POI. I don't know. We'll figure it out. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, pull up our screen reference um, that we have real quick. Nope. Not there. Um, you are going to be in uh, screen captures, uh, recorded folder. And you are going to be in seven days to die. All right, it's working on it, folks. All right. No, I'm sorry. It's not going to be in seven days to die. What am I thinking? It's going to be in Imperium because we were in Imperium whenever it uh, took the screenshot. All right, so here's our screenshots right here that we grabbed which they're all down here now. And we are going to work on the aerial class starship. So we're going to preview this one, and we're going to open it up in photos. There we go. And we're going to go ahead and just kind of minimize that. We can go ahead and close all this other stuff out of the way. So that's what we're working on right there. Okay. So that is one, two, three, four, five blocks. Um, one, two, three, four, five blocks to the square of the uh, thing, and then we angle down. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to move this over here to the other monitor. Now, you're not going to be able to see that one uh, just yet. All right, so let's go, ah, uh, let's say right here, one, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, 
Oh, come on, T. We're throwing blocks everywhere now. We're going to bring that um, up. Because we got to build a certain way in this game. And see, we are... Let's um, bring our picture back over here on this screen. And we need to see how uh, we not go to the next screen or something. Oh, maybe we got to zoom out. There we go. All right, we are... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, wait. Well, I'm counting that wrong. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight blocks high. Okay, let's move this. Back over here. Let's go back in here. Okay. Go ahead and throw these down. There we go. All right. Now we need uh, how many did we say high? We need uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. Dummy. Stop that. Oh, wait. My bad. It's that one. Because we need to... Uh, um, let's move... There we go. Move some stuff around. Because we need to uh, make foot uh, landing gears. This is going to be the bottom half of the ship right here. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Now, the way the stability works in this game is a little weird. Um, so, you know, we're going to do the best we can with what we've got to work with. Okay, so there's one more right there. All right. Now, we need to go ahead and pull our picture back up over here. And we're going to go with uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. So go back in here. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, the eleventh one. All right. We're going to just kind of do some stuff like that. Okay, that way we know that that's where we're going to go ahead and bring this up. Uh, here as well. Now this is just the uh, shell part of the ship. Um, anytime you uh, do a uh, ship, you always do the shell part of the ship. And then you just work around it, fill it in and all that stuff. Okay. Oop. Well, we'll need that there anyway, so. All right. I know it looks kind of ugly for some of you folks. Um, we don't need that just, just yet. All right. Let's go ahead and, uh, yeah, we can bring that up here. Bring that here. There we go. Uh, 
let's see. All right, there's that. All right, let's look at our picture again. Um, let's bring our picture back over here. Let's zoom out, and let's go ahead and... Uh, We went too far. Back up. Back up one more. All right, there we go. All right, let's see. So that would be one, two, three, four out would be what that would be. Okay. All right, now we need to... Okay, we need to get rid of this one, and then we need to rotate, or we need to change the shape of that block. Looks like it's going to be um, let's see, it's going to be a corner block, um, and I know that we have that block in here just a matter of finding that block. Let's see here. Where ah, this is it right here. All right. Oh. This block is going to go here. Oop, shit. All right. Let's go ahead and get rid of that one. That one. Let's go ahead and uh, put another block right there. All right. go all right and we're going to just use this as a placeholder for right now all right so we got one. <laughs> that would be one two three four um, like I said, we're just using that as a placeholder. So we got three of those. All right, beautiful. Now we need to find our little corner piece, which we have that also. It's just a matter of finding the blocks. We've, we've got the blocks, folks. It's just a matter of finding the blocks. Is that it? Ramp corner. Let's see. Yes, it is. Okay. All right. One more right here. Okay. Like I said, these these right here, they're, they're just placeholders for right now. Um, we'll, we'll come in and we'll change those out. All right. Now let's go ahead and uh, bring this over here to our little uh, ramp that we have. It would be the uh, ramp block. Oh, let's see. No, we got one. Did I go down too far? I think I went down too far. Let's see. Um, let's see. Ramp wedge. Okay, that's nice. Ah, here we go. Perfect. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's uh, bring our picture back over so we can count. All right. 
So that would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Let's move that over here. It's actually nine. And um, we done it. All right. Now, uh, I know we have this block in there because I've seen it. Um, it's a really, really weird type of block. I know, I know that it is in Seven Days to Die because I've seen it. Um, it is, it forms like a triangle on one side and then goes into like a weird looking shape on the other side. Um, so yeah, it, it will spend a lot of time looking for blocks and stuff like that because Seven Days to Die has so many blocks to choose from. And if we can't find the specific block that we are looking for, we definitely have a lot of awesome options that we could probably use later on. Uh, so, yeah, let's just thumb through here. I know that the block that I'm looking for is definitely in here because I've ran across it once or twice thinking, wow, that's cool. So let's see here. All right, I don't see it in that section. Let's see if it's in this section right here. Ah, oh, there it is right there, folks. See, I told you. All right, now it's just a matter of uh, rotating it the way it needs to be. There it is, right there. All right, let's go ahead. And, see, I told you it had it. All right, let's uh, see if we can put it over here on this side. Come on, rotate for me, make sure that we're doing that. Ah, oh, is there any way we can <laughs> back up the rotation? If there is, I don't know. Uh, I'm not, actually really not too familiar with building in seven days to die myself, but that's okay. We're going to learn together, folks. There it is. All right, beautiful. Now. We do have a, another block that will fit that perfect. Um, and let's see, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this would be the first block. Okay. And we need nine of those. All right, now let's... Um, There's another block here, but I don't think it's, uh, I think it will be in here. Uh, yep, that, that's it right there. All right. All right. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. See, let me double check my count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, the ninth one needs to be um this block right here. So we're going to go ahead and copy this block. Okay. And we're going to go ahead and uh, get rid of that one and that one. Okay. And then we're going to rotate this block. Oh, there we go. that one all right and let's uh paste 
beautiful now. Um, what we're going to do is instead of um, we're going to change it up. Here's where we're going to change it up a little bit. Uh, let me grab my picture real quick, and I'll kind of go over it with you and show you. Um, come on, you stupid thing. <laughs> Let's see, picture. There you go. All right. Now, what we're going to do, instead of us going in like that and then coming back out like that, we're just going to go ahead and go straight across. So we need one, two, three, and then four. So we're going to change it up a little bit, okay? All right. Let's go back into this. Uh. We need the half block. Do we have the, no, we had not put those down yet. Okay, not a problem. All right. Let's see here. That would be under this little section right here. That would be this lovely thing right here. All right. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. All right, now here's where we're going to go back out again. Uh, let me pull up my little picture. Shit, I closed the picture out. Dummy. Right, let me bring this over here so I can actually read it. Uh, recorded videos. Uh, can't believe I closed my picture out. That's about stupid. <laughs> but it happened. It happened. All right. Where's my picture? I know I just had the picture. Yep. I am hunting my picture down, folks, that I closed out. Had a silly moment. Let's move this over here so I can actually see the chat. And then let's thumb through and find the picture again that uh, silly me closed out. Where's it at? Where's it at? Come on. I know you're in here. Let's see. I would need. Uh, let's uh, go ahead. Let, let's go ahead and open it up in my uh, GIMP program. Because GIMP will allow me to um, swap through the pictures, and I'll show you what I mean by that here in just a second. All right, here's my GIMP program, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to add some more pictures to this, and that will allow me to select the uh, pictures and stuff like that a lot faster than thumbing through them. So, yeah, just give me just a second. We'll go ahead and get this sorted out. <laughs> Seems like I'm missing pictures or something. But we have enough we can reference what we need to, though, for sure, for sure. Here's another one right here. Uh, that's a weird looking uh, That's a weird ass picture format, guys. Okay. Well, uh, where are we at? We are right there. Okay, so we came out here. Uh, let's get a top view. So we went one, two, three, four. So we need to go one, two, three. 
three hours. Okay. Yeah, that, that is right, right? Uh, we can always zoom in, too. That would be, that's where we're at. We, we just went, well, actually, we went straight across here, so we went right there. So we need uh, one, two. Okay, okay, okay. Let's move this over here out of the way now. All right, now we need, uh, which block is it? Uh, I think it's this one. One, oh, two, one, two. So I'm just double checking, folks. All right, yeah. And then we need uh, the little triangle. Which is right here. There we go. Do 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 do. All right. Now we need the ramp. Uh, where are you at? Ah, here you are. One. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Now we need our little triangle. Thing again, to be this one right here. One, two. All right. Now let's uh bring our picture back over. Let's go ahead and so we got a little triangle. Okay. That's one thing about GIMP is you can zoom in the pictures and stuff like that. But let's go ahead and uh, move this over here. Let's go ahead and can we move this over? No, nope, not an option. Okay, well, no worries. All right, let's go ahead and move that right here. All right, so we want one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, then we got to go one, Two, three, four, five in. Okay. And that's where this one will come in at. Uh, which will be this block right here. All right. One. Two. Three, four, five. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Look at that. How cool is that? I know, right? It's crazy. All right, now this is where we're going to bring our little tilt triangle thingy back in. Right here. One. All right, then our little ramp. One, two, three, four. Ironically, it matches the front, folks. <laughs> Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, let's get rid of you. Let's go ahead and bring these to the end. Um, we're just going to grab a block here. Oh, come on. Uh, come on, Chief. Stop pushing buttons everywhere. Uh, let's go ahead and grab this. There we go. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. All right, let's see. One, two, there we go. Like I said, we're still working out the uh, fall rate thingy. All right, now let's go ahead and uh, throw that in there. All right, now I don't know if this is going to keep breaking or anything like that, but it makes us feel better, right? All right. All right. There, okay, there we go. Right there, folks. All right, let's go ahead and um, get our blocks. Uh, would be this bad boy right here and that one right there. And we'll go ahead and fill this in. <coughs> Beautiful. All right. <coughs> now. Let's uh, bring up our GIMP program again. All right, let's go back over here. Uh, let's go with what we see in the picture. All right. Okay. Now we're right here. And let's look at our GIMP picture right here. Oh, we didn't mean to maximize it. Let's kind of move it up out of the way. Oh, fucking whoever done that with Windows just really, people didn't want that where you bring it up and it automatically maximizes. That's, that's stupid. Okay, so we need to go from here. One, two, three, and then the fourth one back is where we start angling up. Let's get a better angle. Uh, one, two, Three, four, right, right. Does that look right to y'all? Let's go with this one. One, two, three, four. The fourth one back. The fifth one needs to go angled. All right, let's move this over here so I can see that. Okay, and let's just kind of move it right there. All right, when I said the fourth one, okay, so that means that we need to go. Let's grab our little block. Let's go ahead and get us a square. Just a square, just a placeholder. All right, and let's see. Let's go with one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, now the fifth one back to be this one is going to be a half step it's actually what that was going to be which is going to be this one right here okay and that's going to be 
all the way let's see one past that okay so it's going to be one if that was in line all right right there that's how far it's going to be all right let's go ahead and uh Grab that shape right there. All right, let's go ahead and grab this shape right here. One, two, three, four, six, seven. Are we even? Okay. Now we need to angle this one. All right. Hopefully we have that shape. Yes, we do. Look at there. Oh, look at that, folks. All right, now here's where um, this block, which will be this one. Yeah. See, yeah, that'll work. Beautiful. Okay. Now, finding the shape. <laughs> this is going to be the uh, fun part right here, folks. Is finding this shape which I think we had to get a little creative with it all right yeah this is this is gonna be the uh, kicker right here folks is finding let's see we went one back yep we went one back Okay, and finding that shape that's going to match that. That's that's going to be the fun part right there, folks. So let's go ahead and bring this back over here. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and straighten this up. Because we can go ahead and fill this in with uh, our squares real quick. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Grab our square block, beautiful. And we'll come back, we'll paint all these shapes and stuff like that to the best that we can to you know oops put one out of place that's all right that's why we got that kink all right now that you're just getting in the way now <laughs> yep we fill this in it'll actually help us uh as we're building it so yeah we'll go ahead and Fill this in. All right. Yep. Yeah, here we go. All right. Let's see here. I'm willing to bet that Seven Days to Die, for this little blending, this little shaping, I'm almost willing to bet that Seven Days to Die has better fitting blocks than Imperium Galactic Survival. I'm almost willing to bet that. All right, let's go ahead and get rid of this. 
right, let's get rid of this. Let's see. I know that we have double layers of floors in this vehicle, so we're going to go ahead and bring these out here. Go ahead and straighten this up right here also. Uh, yep, there you are. Beautiful. Oop, we throw that down somewhere. It went somewhere, folks. <laughs> I'm not sure where it went, but it went somewhere. Now, I think about the only thing that we would have problems with, folks, in the recreation of these things from Imperium Galactic Survival would be the glass. But I think Chief may have... Yeah, we're just going to throw that on the ground. It don't matter. <laughs> I think Chief may have found a solution for that that will work and it won't be all that bad. Um, Obviously, it's going to be bulletproof glass, um, but I'll show you here in just a second. Maybe. All right, so look at there. It's actually starting to take shape, folks. I know, isn't that, isn't that cool? That is so freaking cool, isn't it? I know, it's crazy. I'm excited. I don't know about y'all, but I'm excited. Um, now, one thing we can definitely do for sure while we're at it is we can go ahead and take these blocks and we can go ahead and bring, um, let's see, uh, that would, you would be under, yeah, right here. We can go ahead and uh, get this block in place right here. Bam, look at that. How crazy is that? I know, right? That's crazy. That's just crazy, Chief. We can actually go ahead and bring this block down, too. Go wait. All right. Oh, come on. Yeah. Get in there. There you go. <clears throat> All right. Let's go over here and sort this one out now. Oh. Oh, come on. We almost had it. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and get rid of that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one, and that one. Okay. There we go. Sometimes you just got to clean some stuff up, folks. All right, we are looking at um, let's see more of a side view. Uh, I need a side view of the aerial now. Ah, here we go. For some reason, it saved it in a Weird, weird looking format. I've never seen that format. Um, okay. Now we have that. I think, guys, that's actually dual block. Or it may be one block. Let's uh, do a uh, one block and see what that does for us. Okay, let's start back here. Mm, let me plop over here real quick. I 
I think, um, well, one thing I do know, we're going to have to put a uh, solder block here to get our um, uh, thing. And I'm thinking that I used one of these type of blocks. Uh, let's let's see here. Let's see what we have to work with in that section. Let's see what we have to work with in this section. But I'm willing to think that I used one of those half blocks because I remember you can walk through that ship. Ah, one of these blocks right here. I'm thinking that's what I used. Um. But, let's see. Get the little stretch on real quick. Um, let's run back over here to our um, thing. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's get a... Uh, mm, not really good. Yeah, okay, so that's one, two, three. It's definitely three blocks wide. Okay, so that shows that's three blocks wide. All right, did we, because the fifth block, okay, so we built everything off. Okay, let's do this. Um. Let's put us a placeholder in right here for the center block. Okay. All right, because that's the center of ship. So we need to uh, move this. Back to this copy block. There we go. It's gonna work out for us now. I was thinking that this something wasn't quite right um, about this whole fiasco, and couldn't really um, put my finger on what wasn't right about it. All right, let's get a side view. All right, this is going to go all the way to well, let's see here. actually going to go um, let's see here it's going to go to right here um, from what I'm looking at in the picture uh Yep, that's, that's exactly where it's going to go in the picture. All right. Let's copy rotation. All right, we need one more. View. All right, we're going to go ahead and get this lined out right here. We're going to go ahead and fill this in while we're down here. Um, uh, let's, um, you know what? Actually, no, we're not. No, we're not. Um, but what we are going to do is we are going to 
take that, 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 that. Out, because that is, um, all right, let's go ahead and copy shape, copy rotation. All right, now that turns right here. Okay, uh, which would be this lovely little piece right here. All right, now we have some weird looking blocks that I think is going to fit perfect right there, folks. Almost. Ooh, I knew seven days to die. Add some blocks. It just, just eats Elion up. <laughs> I knew it. Sweet, this makes life easy for us, folks. Oh, this makes life real easy for us. Nice. Where'd it go? All right, let's see. That'd be this block right here. All right, and then that will be this. Actually, I ain't even got to do that. Just, there we go, copy. No, uh, this one, my bad. Copy, there we go. All right, now there are windows that are here and here. So let's look. at our window option. Oh, we don't need caps lock on. All right, let's go ahead and get rid of that. Uh, I think we need to uh, go with glass. Um, all right, here's the window storefront. Window store front full. Alright, let's see. Window frame. Those are busted window frames, it looks like. Uh window store four sided. Not sure what those are. Um, but we're limited on our windows. on how we can do our windows. Seems like there's different windows. Um, let's see here. Hmm. Those look interesting. Ooh, bulletproof glass ramp. Oh, folks, I think this is what we're looking for right here. Oh, yeah, I think this is what we're looking for right here, guys. Bulletproof glass rock. I think we found our glass, folks. I did not know. Yeah. All right. Mm, man, that's that's nice. Okay. All 
All right. Well, this is kind of a little tricky. Okay. Now, <laughs> um, I don't see any triangle type um, corners for the glass. So we're going to have to get creative with that, folks. Um, yeah, we're going to definitely have to get creative with that. Let's get rid of these frames. Um, and get us some, uh, tinted, uh, glass. All right, let's see. Um, all right, we're going to have to get a little inventive with the, uh, See here, what do we got to work with? Ah, uh, mm, decisions. Can we make this work? Let's see here. Let's just look, see what we got right here, real quick, and see if we can make it work with something very, very cool. And I'm not seeing anything other than this. Let's see. If well, we can make this work. Well, I know we can make it work, but I'm just saying. Uh, mm, right now, let's go with... Uh, I think that's as thin as we can get that, actually. Um, if, yeah, that's as thin as we can get that. That's all right, though. It, it works. Or, ooh, no. Oh, that's nice. If we can get that, do we have a corner piece in that, though? That's, that's what we need to know. Is, is there a corner piece that fits that and if we have a corner piece that fits that then we are steamboat um, that's not a corner piece that looks really close mm. that's not a corner piece mm, man so close so close I mean, it needs to be three sides. Three sides. Mm, man, that is just so close. Is that? Got that. We just need a corner piece. Let's see if we got any in here that would work. I mean, that's just kind of like a... Mmm... We got a corner piece right there, but that, that is not going to work. Basic, what do we got? Basic, okay. Oh, let's see, keep half, no, no, let's see, round, what if, 
do we have anything in the ground, maybe, that would work for what we're looking for? Let's see what that one does. Experiment, people. Experiment. Alright, that's a little high. Alright, let's go ahead and continue with our search. Mm, see, that's, you know, that's the thing that, you know, you might not always find something that will work. We found that, but then that only gives you just a little thing, and it doesn't quite stretch out. I mean, we could probably do something like this. You know, but it's just enough. Man, we need that corner piece right there. So let's, let's keep digging. I refuse to give up hope just yet. Whole stairs. D -b -b -b. Let's go back in here and see if we can. What is that? That's definitely weird. What is that? I mean, that's just like a... Oh, okay, okay, I see now. It was really confusing me. Um, let's see what this one does. No, it's still going to be a little, little tall. Hmm... Mm, I know, guys, this is crazy. Uh, let's, let's go to the next page. Yeah, let's go to the next page. Let's see. See, those are angles, angles, angles. That might be might work for what we're looking for. That, I think, folks. Let's just have a look and see. You know what? We're going to make this one work. Why? Because that's the best one we got yet. Beautiful. All right, now let's go ahead and uh, copy, shape. Aha. We're steamboat now, folks. Now, let's um, see if we can go ahead and bring, oh, let's go copy this shape right here. All right. No, you rotate.
There we go. That's the representation I'm looking for right there. Okay. There we go. What do y'all think, folks? Yeah, that's going to work. All right, let's go ahead and grab a copy of that. Here we go, folks. We got this. We got this. Because I want you to be able to go inside the POI also. Um, yeah. That's, that's going to work. All right. Let's see here. Let's uh, see if uh, we are um, uh Yeah, I know we got a uh, a thin block, square block. Uh, it's a matter of finding it, isn't it? Because we come across it, which should match up with that. Might be in here. I, I think, let's see, is this it? Okay, it's a little thin. Um, it's a little thin. A little thin, folks. All right, let's see. We've got this one, but the thing is about that one is it needs to be on one side or the other. Um, that's the problem about that one. So let's. Oh, that's nah, a little thin too. <laughs> but we might have to make that work. Let's go with this. That was getting better. Uh, let's go with. Um, let's just look and see if we got another one. That one was the pole plate. Let's see. Do we have another? You know what? Looks like it's going to be the pole plate, folks. Uh, looks like it's going to be that because I don't think we have one in here because it's more of your triangle shapes and stuff like that. Yeah, okay, so it looks like it's going to have to be the pole plate, guys. That's all right. That gives us, um, hmm, actually, you know what? Gives me some creativity ideas. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. I'm thinking that we can go ahead and kind of spice this up a little bit. Let's go ahead and come on. Oh, that's the wrong button, dummy. Beautiful. That's going to work, guys. Let's go ahead and fill this in.
Ah, there we go. Ah, now we can actually let's do this. Uh, let's see. There we go. In case you're wondering what we're doing, folks, we're giving you a floor to stand on. All right, that's not going to work. We need to drop this down lower. All right. We didn't know. Now we know. That'll work. That'll work. Yep, that will work, folks. Now we know. So we need to be at least too high for the floors for you to move around. Okay, uh, in Imperium, you only need one square. So not a problem. Now we know. Well, it's a good thing we found this out early. Now we're going to put some stairs back here somewhere. So let's do that. All right. So let's go ahead and get out of God mode. Um, all right. So here you are. You're all up in here. You know, you're ready to hoo hoo some stuff. What not have you. You know what I'm saying? All right. Now I thought about doing something like this. But if I did that, then I wouldn't be able to do that. I mean, I could get away with it on the sides. You know, maybe right there. Uh, you know, just kind of dress it up a little bit. All right. Go back to our weapon. So, you know, this will be your little. I mean, that's you have no room to jump, but you know, you'll come up the stairs and all that stuff. You know, but remember, this is just a recreation of the ships and stuff like that. Okay. So, that being said. Uh, let's see here. Let's go ahead and fill this in right here. Um, there we go. Oop, throw the block on the ground. Do, 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 do. That bad boy is filled in, folks. Sweetness. All right. That's actually just looking really, really, really good. Um, but we do need to go ahead and bring out this stuff. Okay. Because we got... 
wrong spot, boy. There we go. Let's see if I can bring this out. Like so. Alright, let's go over to this other side. And let's do the same with this one. Go. And remember, we've got to con uh, consider that we are going to have to figure out how to build us some uh, landing gears with what we have to work with. And I don't think that we're really going to have a problem with that in all of the options that we have to build from. If I'm to be honest, folks, uh, I don't think that we're going to really have a problem there. Um, let's go ahead and build a, a leg down here. See, we went one, two, three back. Okay, so where are you at? Uh, one, two, three back. Give me just one second, folks. Folks, I apologize for that. That was weird. So, I have my door open because it's nice and cool and stuff like that. And it almost sounded like something sizzling. Like um, when you throw a piece of barbecue on the barbecue grill and you hear it sizzle. That's what it sounded like right outside the door. And I don't see anything that could have caused that or anything like that but yeah weird sounding okay uh let's get rid of these uh blocks right here okay so this is um let's go ahead and uh bring this one down to um, that one that one Go ahead and get rid of that. Let's go ahead and do this to the other side. There we go. All right. And then right here. Beautiful. All right, now let's go ahead and get us uh, some more of these. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and uh, somewhat build the walls. Um, just throw this placeholder in there real quick. Just to kind of, you know, give it some character. Yep. And 
right here. And we'll come back and we'll um, build um, other um, little um, um, we'll come in and we'll spend some more time on the walls. We'll, we'll remove blocks and try to put some character into the walls and stuff like that with different various shapes and things of that nature you know so yeah we're just throwing this in here right now just to you know give us uh something to look at oh throw that off didn't i <laughs> uh, And I've been actually wanting to do this for a long time. But like I had mentioned earlier in the uh, beginning of the stream, I just put that in there for a placeholder. Nobody has done this yet. Uh, and whenever I've talked to other people about the idea of doing this, that they, you know, it's like, I don't know, it's like something wrong. So we're going to do something wrong. <laughs> we're going to do it, folks. Right here, you heard it here first. Yep, right here, folks. It's happening. Nope. Put that one in there, Ron. All right. I mean, look at that. That's cool, isn't it? How cool is that? That is freaking cool. Okay, uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and uh, dress this side up right here. Uh, copy. There we go. Now, the reason we use steel blocks, it's, it's a POI. And we will probably come back and we will uh, make some destructive blocks where you can destroy and stuff like that, you know. Remember, we got to use what um, Imperium, or not Imperium, but what Seven Days to Die gives us to work with. So, with that being said, you know. We can only do so much. All right, let's go ahead and uh, grab a copy of that real quick. Copy rotation. Beautiful. All right. Like I said, nobody that I know of has even thought about doing this. You know. So we're going to do this for you. Okay. Now, we'll we'll change all this stuff up. You know, these are just somewhat placeholders for right at the moment. Come on, rotate. There we go. Because we're going to, um, well, I mean, we're going to spend a pretty good amount of time on each ship and uh, try to bring you the best quality that we can on the POIs. Oop. And we're going to try some things. We're going to experiment with some things. And we're just going to try to get them as close as possible. We'll maybe make them. She put the blocks everywhere. May even make them better than uh, uh, the actual uh, what Imperium Galactic Survival offers. Right. Now we're gonna bring this out and stuff like that. We're just, like I said, folks, we're just making this a uh, placeholder for the moment. Um. Uh, We're 
just filling it in. Because we still got the front to do, the hangar deck to do. Um, of course, I put the occasional block in the wrong spot. <laughs> Yep, just about got this bad boy. Put that in the wrong spot again. All right, let's go ahead and connect that. This is our floor, of our main floor of the uh, aerial class. Just about finished with uh, this part, and then, you know, we'll get this right here finished, and then uh, what we'll do is we will uh, go ahead and end this episode here. Yeah, I know, folks, this episode's coming to an end, and I'm sorry for that. But I do got to do things. Oh, blocking the wrong spot again. All right. Here we go. Then we got to think of how are we going to do the lights in this thing. That's something else too, folks. So how are we going to do the lights? Because some of the lights on the starships, they blink red. Then, you know, is there a storyline, a story arc that could be done with this too? Now, what we're going to do is we're going to recreate the vessels. And then we'll come back and we'll make a recreated uh, versions of those that are destroyed or weathered or damaged or something like that. So, you know, we're not just going to have uh, all new shiny, pretty ships and stuff like that. Uh, we don't need you, you, or you. All right. We don't need you, or you, 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 you. You messed up. Um, you were a mess up, too. All right. Um, let's see. Let's go ahead and fill this uh, wall in right here also. Real quick, just you know, that way we can see the whole outline of the ship. Oop, we'll come back and fix you later. And I'm not quite sure how to go about doing the hangers, I'll have to figure out how to make one that's closed. And then one that's open. That way you can fly your gyrocopter in there if you decide that you want to. But this is all going to be for vanilla build. Okay. <clears throat> Almost looks like that we're a little 
thick. Almost looks like we might need to go a little thinner on the ship. But, you know, like I said, we'll, we'll, we'll figure it all out. We'll figure it out together, guys. So, yep, you'll be able to come in. Let's go ahead and get a gun. Pew, pew, pew. Bad zombie, bad zombie. <laughs> Alright, let's just kind of go out here and take a little look, see at it. Alright, let's... Uh, There we go. Mm. Now we left that right there in the back. Back there, we left that open because we're going to experiment with that. All right, so let's go ahead and get us a screenshot. Um, I got to jump over here and make sure that I'm still streaming to y'all okay there we go all right now let's jump over here and get another screenshot and get rid of that and then screenshot there we go beautiful all right folks well we've got a lot of accomplished today and i hope that you like what you are seeing i hope that you enjoy what I am trying to bring you the community and definitely if you're liking what you're seeing give a follow over here on twitch and if you can't make the live streams that's all right like and subscribe over on my youtube channel uh, which the links to those are in somewhere over here in my uh, um um uh, discord not discord um uh, well, that's over here too. They're somewhere over here in my Twitch channel, somewhere for my Discord and my YouTube. And definitely, you know, if you can't make the live streams, come and see me over there on YouTube because I will be uploading this video over there. And you should have this video available by tomorrow uh, afternoon at the very latest because I've got to, obviously, I'm recording the video. I've got to throw in the little intro blah 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 and export it and then upload it you know it's it's it's, it's a process <laughs> so uh, an eight minute video takes about four and a half hours to do this is a uh, minute or an hour and 53 minute video so you know you can kind of figure it all out you know it's, it's going to be a process so but folks thank you for watching and i hope you enjoy what you're seeing and as always, happy gaming, and we'll catch you in the next stream.